We're looking for quality candidates. Many of the candidates that we hire don't have all of the qualifications when we do hire them. Uh, we are absolutely committed to training those folks, uh, providing the opportunity, uh, and even the cost associated with that if it is the right person and the right fit for our local location. A lot of our advanced training comes to uh, in the field. Uh, we do a lot of training on the computer. Uh, Ferro Gas tries to integrate a lot of technology into the training. And then once we've mastered the curriculum on the computer, we actually go into the field and we start doing installations or as a bobtail delivery driver, we actually ride around with a senior driver. He shows us the ins and outs of uh, you know delivering gas and refilling the truck, uh, keeping the truck up and actually spotting things that could be wrong with the customer site, uh, anything safety wise or fire hazards and or leaks, and we identify those and correct them. I started 10 years ago as a bolt driver, and then I moved my way up from bolt driver to service technician, from service technician to operations supervisor, operations supervisor to operations manager, from operations manager to district manager. When you have a CDL, usually that means you're on the road a lot, and. I got tired of being gone from my family all the time. I wanted a job where I could be home every night and Ferrell Gas was hiring, so I applied and I got hired fairly quickly because it's a very in-demand job. I like working for Ferrell Gas because Ferrell Gas promotes a culture of empowerment. Our corporate offices are in Liberty, Missouri, but each field location and each employee, regardless of role, whether you're a customer service specialist, driver, service tech, or manager, uh, is empowered to do whatever's necessary to take care of the customer and exceed their needs. I just enjoyed the job. When I was an over the road trucker, you don't really meet a lot of people besides other truckers at the truck stop. You talk a little bit to the people at the distribution centers that mostly you go to to unload with. But obviously with Blue Rhino, I'm meeting the retailers. I'm talking to customers at each location. You get a lot of people that will come up to you while you're working a cage and ask you a question. So I enjoyed all that and just it was different, you know, I wasn't running the same route every day. You know, I wasn't doing that when I was over the road either, but they tend to run you in the same areas. Whereas Blue Rhino, one day I could be in Virginia, one day I could be down in Wilmington, I might be in Fayetteville the next day. So it just had a lot more variety to it. I appreciate all my employees and what they go through. You know, I'm not afraid to get out there and drive a truck. I'm not afraid to get out there and be in service. And I think my employees appreciate that I'm, I'm willing to get out there and be in the truck with them if I need be, or be behind the desk and answer emails or do what I need to do. Being in management has taught me from the starting position to where I am now to appreciate every position because every position is important.